Hi, this is Michelle Busilli with Highlands Resort Realty, and I'm here at the Highlands Golf Club at Seven Springs. So now what? John Tierney, my partner, is up at the pro shop. So why don't we head up there and see what's going on? John. Hey Michelle, why don't we go take a walk in the pro shop? Hey, that sounds good. What a great day here. The pro shop here. It's Julie, the pro shop manager. Wait, Julie. It's working. Let's on, head on up to the lounge. I'm going to try to walk backwards, I'll end up falling. But it's a very rustic setting, you can tell by the railings they have, and you see a little more of that up at the lounge here. Come on up. See those beams? You can't leave without going out on the deck, Michelle. All right. Get the door for you. Thank you. Make sure you get that great view. Maybe head over to the left. Well, I'm, wait a minute. Maybe your other left. Before we leave here, well, I think I see ears over there on the other side. Why don't we go have a talk with him? Yeah, that sounds good. All right. And here we are with Dave Falakovich. Uh, Dave goes by the nickname of Ears here at uh, Highlands. And he's the director of golf at uh, Highlands uh, Ventures. Dave, could you tell us a little bit about, oh, welcome Dave. Thanks, man. Thanks for having me. Can you tell us a little history about the the uh, course here? Yeah, the golf course opened in the late 60s, early 70s. Oh, okay. Um, and something that a lot of folks never knew is actually the back nine was originally the front nine. Yeah, I didn't know that. And then uh, that got switched uh, just after the first couple years of, uh, uh, of play. Uh, Fred Haddock switched it back to what currently is uh, the back nine. Oh, okay. Yeah, which was yeah, which was kind of cool. Yeah, yeah. So we learned something there. And um, I'm curious: is, is the uh, club open to the public, or is it membership, or a combination? How does that all work? Yeah, we're uh, by no means a private facility. Um, we do cater to uh, a pretty large membership. Uh, we like to kind of give you, you know, a real relaxed atmosphere country club setting as you are a member, but we do offer uh, uh, rates to, uh, to public play. Uh, we host uh, corporate events, charity events, um, so we have a vast amount of players here. Okay, I think uh, you have an event going on here uh, actually this morning. We do. And in fact, speaking of events, we were over at um, Hidden Valley this past weekend. You had an event there. Are you, is there an affiliation with uh, Hidden Valley as well? There is. Our company actually owns uh, both golf courses. Okay. Um, so we have, uh, which really gives us a lot of flexibility, especially, you know, when we go back to the membership portion. If we have an event here, your membership qualifies you uh, for both golf courses. Okay. Uh, so, you know, vice versa, you know, you want to play over there. We have something going on. You have the ability of having, you know, 36 holes, two different types oh, of wow. golf courses. Uh, really, really nice. Uh, piece of the puzzle uh, for us to uh, inquire more memberships, you know, two totally different types of playable golf courses. Yeah. And that's what's really fun. Yeah, well, that's great. I didn't know that either. 
What are some of the amenities that you have here at the course? Uh, obviously, fully stocked uh, golf shop. Oh, okay. Um, everything companies from Cutterbach, Footjoy, uh, Under Armour, Titleist. Then uh, obviously the the infamous T Top Lounge. Everybody yeah, has to come and see that. It's really you beautiful. Know. We'll get some footage of that later too. Yeah, it's it's kind of a tough office window to look out of. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you got that right. And you, you also, there's also a, a, the driving range is right yeah. behind us, right? Yeah, <clears throat> uh, full driving range and practice facility. Um, that is all uh, inclusive. If you have a full membership with us, uh, you know you just want you get <clears throat> get your membership. You don't want to go out and play. Just work on your game. You come up. You have full use of the practice oh, wow. range, which is nice. And the, and the practice range is also just open up to the uh, the general public. Oh, okay. Yeah, I love the I love hitting balls. So that's that's, yeah, a, me that's too. a great option. Great option. Well, that's wonderful. I think we got a taste of what's going on up here. Uh, do you want to anything else we should touch on? Maybe a phone number for the people if they uh, want to call and make a reservation. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> easiest way to get most of the information is to go to Highlands Golf Club okay. uh, and go on the website. That'll list uh, all the rates for both golf courses. <clears throat> It'll also touch on uh, the membership rates. Something to really think about too, you know, if you're, uh, you know, a couple looking to get a membership, the first membership is based off of one rate, and then as you add membership, second membership, third membership, that rate actually goes down, but yeah. you still qualify for all the benefits of a full membership. All right. Well, great. Well, Dave, thanks very much for spending some time with Absolutely. us. Absolutely, it's my pleasure. Thank you. Okay. Good deal. Nice to see you. Thanks, John. This is Michelle Busilli and John Tierney. We're with Highlands Resort Realty, the only on-site real estate company here at Seven Springs Resort located in Center Lobby. And we're here to assist you with all of your real estate needs. Until next time.